There is no coincidence in the world. Everything is the result of our thoughts. What can we do to attract what we really want? If you have temporarily forgotten your dreams and goals due to the weight of life, despair, frustration, etc., I hope this video will serve as an opportunity to remind you of your dreams and goals. 1. The journey of change begins with defining what is most important to you. Your time on this earth is limited. What are you going to do with the time you have? How are you going to spend your precious and endless future? 2. Time is an asset that gives everyone the same amount for free. But at the same time, it is also one of the most expensive. This is because it cannot be replaced with something else or returned. Time, along with health, is the most important asset in our lives, and at the same time, the most scarce asset. 3. Success is not a grand future. If you don't live each day to the fullest, the future you desire will never be created. Making today beautiful leads to a beautiful tomorrow. And to do so, you have to reflect on how you live today. On the path of life, the footprints you have always walked remain. Your future will also be determined by what kind of footprints you leave behind. 4. Success does not linger by your side for long. When failure comes to you, it rarely leaves. But success always prepares to leave you. If you want to succeed until the end, embrace your passion. Only passion will ensure your success. If you lose passion, don't expect anything. 5. Once you start, it becomes easier to continue. The act of getting out of the house is harder than jogging three miles. The act of sitting down at your desk is harder than writing a proposal that spans ten pages. Even with motivation, starting is not made easier. Rather, you will be motivated to finish once you start. 6. People who have discovered their own meaning are unwavering. This is because they found a reason to bear the weight of their life. The reason to live doesn't lie in grandiose things. Protecting your people, accomplishing your work, cultivating the power to view your life more positively, and sometimes just looking at the twinkling stars in the night sky are enough. The power that keeps us alive comes from simple, yet very certain, small meanings. 7. A person anxiously longing for something often exhausts too much energy in advance, making it difficult to derive sufficient satisfaction even when they attain their desires. On the other hand, those who can wait for the happiness they want do not choose the path of despair even if it does not eventually come. 8. The life we can claim to have lived the best throughout our lifetime is not one where we overcome the circumstances we find ourselves in. It is a life where we don't consider ourselves happy or unhappy due to the environment given to us. It is a life where we don't think we are happy or unhappy because of anyone else. If you have lived that way, your life has been very well lived. 9. To reach the summit of a mountain, one must pass through valleys, and to find an oasis, one must cross deserts. Moreover, to see a rainbow, it must first rain, and to cultivate colorful and beautiful flowers, one must endure a harsh winter. In this way, to welcome good days, you must first endure difficult and painful days. 10. Most people seem to believe that what they want to do somehow emerges on its own from somewhere. But that idea was very wrong from the beginning. This is because what you want to do is not appearing on its own, but what you look for. If you don't actively seek from the beginning, you will never find it, no matter how much time passes. 11. Look back on what happened in the past. Learn valuable lessons from the past and create a better present through learning. You can't change the past but you can learn from the past. If the same situation happens again, we can act differently 
and live more happily in the present. 12. The more I hated others and resented the world, the more unhappiness and suffering came back to me. It's a natural consequence. As I cursed the world, there was no way the world would bestow blessings upon me. However, as I began to embrace gratitude and humility, things started to unravel like untangling a knotted thread, and I started to live a much more wonderful life that I had never even imagined. 13. Negative thoughts are seeds that we plant in the world through complaining. Then there will be weeds all over. It's essential to shield ourselves from the negative attitudes of others. From now on, transform your negative words into constructive ones. Your thoughts make your life, and your words reveal your thoughts. 14. Habits work like compound interest. Just as money grows with compound interest, if habits are repeated, the results multiply. At some point, on some day, even with a very small difference, over the course of a few months or years, the impact can become enormous. The power of good habits and the cost of bad habits will reveal a marked difference. We ignore small changes because it doesn't seem that important at that moment. 15. Like a child learning to walk for the first time, move forward with confidence and strength. You may not see results as quickly as you think. It may be very difficult, or you may feel your limits. Don't stop, though. If you keep moving forward without stopping, the limit will become further and further away. Let go of your worries and walk out. 16. Employees often take a slump for granted, and they try to find the cause somewhere other than themselves. Most of us comfort ourselves in a slump with statements like this. This job isn't the right fit for me, after all. This organization doesn't recognize my true worth, and I'm not someone who should receive this kind of treatment. In its nature, mannerism absorbs emotions of comfort and thrives. 17. Even if it seems reckless, if there is something you desperately need in life, try it without regrets. Life is not a meticulously planned journey. It is not a route that leaves and arrives persistently at a set time. Sometimes, taking one step forward requires taking two steps back, or even ten. 18. We are all painters sitting in front of the canvas of life. Even people who have achieved great achievements in their fields did not start out with an elaborate plan from the beginning. We should always be flexible. This is because the situation you are in changes from moment to moment regardless of your will or intention. 19. Don't say you don't have enough time. You were given the same amount of time given to William Shakespeare, Michael Jackson, Nelson Mandela, Albert Einstein and Mahatma Gandhi in a day. If you simply organize these three things, your relationships, hobbies, and things you read and watch, you will have a lot of free time in your life. 20. Sometimes you have to accept luck. The role of luck in success is much greater than commonly thought. However, schools don't talk about luck, but teach you that you can achieve everything with effort. 